Wait for the uh, the old gamer Uno to pop up. Hey, there we go. Cool. Uh, hi and welcome, everybody. 
Where's the music at in this game? The music is still so kind of like, meh, meh, meh. Yeah, okay. Anyway, hello and welcome to Eco. We are just dabbling around today. Uh, last episode, or last time I played, I guess, I started working on a little bit of a house. Um, something a bit off with the house because I swore you used to, you used to be able to fill things um, over top of water. I um, think I'm wrong there, but that's okay. That is not right. Uh, what the heck was that? Anyway. Come on, building. Building controls always leave something to be desired, in my opinion. It could be better. It could be worse, of course, but anyway. I don't have enough now. Shoot, I need one more. Because I want to have this to be... Oh, uh... What is that? Okay. Well, I actually have some items. My hewn logs and stuff. Because I want to start... How many is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine interior. So let's go back one more. Or let's just go back to two more. I'm going to have to queue up some more hewn logs. So I want to have five by five rooms, or oh, it'd be five by six or whatever this is across. Of course, I'm out of two. There we go. Now, let's queue up some more hewn logs. I think everything else is pretty much done at the moment, so we can just jump right into doing the hewn logs. I can do 100. Let's just do, well, we're going to need all of them. Let's just do 100 regular hewn logs. Leave it at that. Hey, Jeff. Uh, I believe that would be called an echo. <laughs> <laughs> Which, how do you spell echo? E C S. That's oh, it's E C H O. It's there's an e echo echo in here minus the H. <laughs> how you doing today, Jeff? Oh, we got some ready here. Where did they come from? Hmm, somewhere else, I guess. Doing good, good, good. I'm not sure what the uh, the the game. Oops, sheet. Not sure what the game, the community game is going to be for tonight. I don't think there is a thing put up yet about, are you serious? Can I not fall down here anymore? I'm not sure what the game is supposed to be tonight. Depends on what it is. Like, I like the golf game. I know we played that twice now. Uh, or three times? No, two times. Two, two times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Mm, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I actually want to get rid of this last row. Yeah, I know. He's on vacation. He can't even put up a community game page. Slacking indeed. I think right now he's playing his game, so I don't... I don't uh, I don't expect him to be in chat. Uh, I think he's doing his Against the Storm game, which I've never played. I've seen him do it a little bit. Not sure if it's a game that I would like. I don't know. I have so many uh, games kind of on the go. Well, I have so many games on the go that I, that I want to play or that I am playing, but some of them is like, well, what what makes sense to play? I don't know. This. Cause I haven't done any streaming in a while. I'm with two... I am up to, f oh, it didn't update. I'm up to 44 followers. Why didn't that update? I don't know why. Didn't update. Don't know why. So that's uh, that's cool. I got one last, actually it was over, it was 11 hours ago. So it was at 2.15 a.m. So I'm not really sure what that was from, but hey, uh, thank you nonetheless. Put some windows in. I don't think you've ever played Eco, have you, Jeff? I mean, I know you've never played it with, with us. I'm not sure if you have you ever played it or not. It's fun to a point. Um, this is one. This one's gonna go. Whoops. Especially when controls are like that. That double hit, even though you don't ask it to double hit. All right, we got some. Yeah, we're gonna need a lot more hewn logs. That is for darn sure. I always like to build everything out of hewn logs to start with. It's tier one materials, but they're fine, and you know I build boxes. That's kind of my <laughs> kind of my style. Let's just chop down some more trees. There's a buffalo here. Interesting. What's up, dude? Hmm. 
<clears throat> Not with people. I played a couple. Oh, okay. Not with P. Butt pull. <laughs> uh, some of these words, butts, bot, don't make any sense, dude. Or chick. It could be a girl bot. I don't know. I'm assuming it's a dude talking about butts. <laughs> They're interjecting butts things into it. Oh, uh, butts, bot. I was doing uh, my tower defense, rogue tower defense, or rogue, rogue tower, it was called, last night, and there was a, someone in chat. Uh, they didn't follow me or anything. There was two extra people giving me some tips, but no follows out of it, which is fine. And they were, uh, Buttspot was having a field day because he was just going on. You know, after every, I'm sure how many chat messages Buttspot comes up. Maybe it's five or ten, I don't remember. Or not Buttspot, sorry. Buttspot came all the time. I'm thinking of the stream elements. The Buttspot was... Uh, was on all the time last night. Oh, look at that. We're gonna hit down here and this this uh, this is your like skill up, your leveling. This is what you've have going into it, the dark, and then the light blue is what you've uh, gotten in that in like the current session. And the reason why I'm taking some of the leaves off is so it le creates less debris. I'm gonna have to eat too. So I just wanna get a housing going to get my score up. I mean, I am gaining, I don't actually I don't have any stars because this is a solo play, so the game only runs when the game's logged in, like I'm logged in. Normally on a server game, your uh, your housing skill and your food, like at all, your skills, uh, like down here, it keeps counting up. Ooh, what did we hit? Level 5. Oh, let's check out our level 5. Logging level 5. Or carpentry. Oh, sorry. Oh, logging. Where's that benefit? I thought it used to be level 5 benefit maybe they changed something okay level three benefit for carpentry let's see doubles the speed of related tables when alone or increases distracting speed by 20 percent. so i always do the focus workflow typically because it's so much easier to build a separate room and you get double the speed which is super super handy i swear that was a this this should be level five bonus maybe they changed that maybe they changed that anyway when you're playing with a uh, like on a, a server, the game's running all the time, so you're constantly gaining skill points as long as you have food in your stomach, because the food will run every 24 hours. Your your stomach will empty regardless of what you put in it, or if you stop putting things in it within 24 hours, everything will be emptied because you'll eat it all, or you'll digest it all, I guess. All right, so that means in here we should be pumping out hewn logs now. Heating logs are at a rate of what? Four seconds. And does it have... Yeah. Oh, I need to... Okay, hold on. I want to see about getting... Can I get... Oh, I got to get uh, mining... Or not mining. Masonry has to be my next skill. Despite me not really wanting masonry. Because I need it. Because I need to get the... Uh, the module... Basic upgrade two, which is done through masonry, and then carpentry is three, which is where is that at? Down here, basic upgrade three. So you have to do them in order. You can't skip over them, of course. All right. So and everything that I'm doing now, like all the hewn logs, that's giving me logging experience. That's not giving me carpentry experience because logging. Uh, I guess this was introduced maybe I don't know a couple updates ago. Logging is now in, or the hewing, hewing logs are now in the logging tree, not in the carpentry tree. Which kind of makes sense, because you could just, like, you need tons and tons of hewn logs to build anything. Let's see, we have 158. How many are being used at the moment? So, f uh, oh, just as one remaining. And then I have 100 and, uh, it didn't tell me. Okay, so I can make another probably 150. We're just going to do the regular hewn logs. I'm probably going to have to eat. Let's eat some beans. Let's eat some of this. Eat some of this. Eat some of this. And do that. And eat some more. More, more, more. Try to have a little bit of a diverse diet. And there we go. I don't know. It's not terrible. I mean, the balance is nowhere near perfect. But it's it's not bad, actually. How is my tastiness bonus? It's only at 2%. What do I keep eating? Oh, I still have the charred corn in my system. That's the problem. I don't like charred corn. In this update, Jeff is i'm not sure if you're still here but uh they they added something in your your nutrition uh balance diet bonus so that's a bonus if you keep say balance and then your variety bonus which the more things you can have up to 25 percent uh so you can if you eat 20 different things you can get up to 25 percent 
Um, how is it? Twenty-four percent after after twenty food types. Then it has diminishing returns up to fifty. And then this is here the tastiness bonus. This is the coolest one. So every person randomly has foods that they like, that they think are okay, that they dislike, that they hate, and they love. So I don't know my favorite food yet because it would be a thirty percent bonus. Probably like the things that are delicious are twenty percent. Things that are just okay or zero percent bonus, so that's like zero. Tomatoes I don't like, so I get a negative ten. And then charred corn is horrible, but that's still not my least favorite food. Uh, the least favorite food will be minus thirty percent, which is why all these together only add up to plus two, because uh, it has to do with hold on, it has to do with how much of it is part of your diet. Like this, I still have tons of charred corn in my diet, uh, even though it's at five. 5%, the ones that I have most are at just, they're at zero. So it, it, it evens out. It's just how it works. It's very neat because before, Jeff, the way it used to work is every tier level of food, there would be a certain combination or two, three combinations that give you the best score. Um, but now, and then, and, then, and then cooks, in a sense, would only have to, should only, could only have to, or how am I saying it, would only have to cook a certain types of foods and just, emit or get rid of the rest because no one's going to eat them anyway. But now everybody's going to be diverse. I don't know how random it is. Um, maybe, I don't know if it's like 10 different ones, but I mean, there's a lot of food in the game. So it should be pretty randomized, which means that cooks are more viable in the sense and, and, so, and more so farming and like gathering. Because certain things, it's like, okay, we're not going to eat anything that has tomatoes in it, so we don't grow tomatoes anymore or rice or stuff like that. But now... If certain people like certain things, it may, I think it also will keep early game foods, which this, this, the campfire cooking, your basic campfire cooking, anybody can do this now. It used to not be the case, I guess last year, a couple years ago, you know, anybody can do all the basic charred stuff. And then once you get into like the next tier, you need campfire cooking, then you need campfire cooking too, et cetera, et cetera. So yeah, it makes it, I think it's going to make cooking your own food a lot more viable, especially in the beginning to figure out what you like and what you don't like. And then you go from there. And yeah, I'm actually, am I cooking anything? Oh, I'm missing mushrooms. Mm, okay, then we'll just cancel this then. Because what foods do I love? I totally forgot now. Let's see, what do I love? I like charred pineapple, regular corn, not charred corn, pineapple itself. So those are two good ones. Yeah, it, it encourages variety for sure, Jeff. And it keeps people who are cooking busier because you need you're gonna have to cook more foods to supply people who like have like I don't how many things do I have in my stomach right now does it tell me one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seven I have 18 things of the 18 things I have some that are really good some that are okay some that are just okay and then a couple that are not good at all so it's this is only 18 different things I don't have anything else to eat uh, I, do I have pumpkin in my stomach? Let's try a pumpkin. We have some of that. Oh, I can't. My stomach's full. Never mind. But anyway, yeah. So it makes it, it it makes the cooking profession a lot more interesting because you have to keep a constant supply of 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 everything, really. Well, to a point, you're almost going to have people putting in orders. You can use things called contract boards or, or work or, or work. Uh, what the heck are they called? Um contract work parties like so you could maybe set up a contract saying this is the food that i want and you make a contract then the cook could go into your contract like you can see this globally in any contract board and say hey this person wants this this and this so i'm going to make that for them and then i'm going to deliver it to them so yeah it, it, it i like it i like the change it's it's a uh, it's good i'm not uh yeah and they, they the other thing that they changed was how tables like crafting tables whether it be a tool bench a carpenter table, a campfire, anything that draws from a storage. We've been asking for this for a long, long time is to have some sort of filtering system. So now the filtering you have is you can have it be an input chest or it can be an output chest or, or output anything. It doesn't matter where you output it, either a stockpile or not, which is good because you can at least set up saying, you know, this chest here is the inputs from the store sales and they're going to go directly to the cooking machine or the cooking whatever you're cooking with, right? So it, it's helpful. You can't filter them by item without doing it manually, but it's still like a heck of a lot better than what it used to be, which was, well, well there, there wasn't any. <laughs> Basically, there was no, there was no, there was no way of, of filtering. It was really kind of, it was really, it was frustrating, especially later game, trying to figure out, okay, where am I going to draw items from? Stuff like that. 
Uh, four and four. Which doesn't seem right. Oh, I gotta get some more anyway. I'm still waiting. If Wally... If Wally pops into... Oops, what the heck did I do there? Uh, what the heck? If Wally pops into the stream, I will bother him about giving me... Because there is a mod that we always use when we play. It's called the Big Shovel Mod. And it basically... I'm just going to put... I'm going to put two windows here. Because I'm going to use those here. It's called the Big Shovel Mod. Because right now, a shovel only picks up one piece of dirt. One piece of sand. And it's like so not efficient. And there's a mod called Big Shovel Mod where you can pick up 10, 10 items. Hydrating without being asked to be. We're getting there, Jeff. I got to figure out what type of channel or point rewards I have. Hydrate. I was thinking about doing some kind of joke thing or just uh, tell a story. I have lots of stories from back in the, the good old days from the 80s and 90s. <clears throat> I do like some nice water, though. Not, not too cold, though. I don't like cold water. I keep falling in this stupid hole. Oh, oh, there's a meteor. 29 days. Yeah, farm tales. Yeah, if, if it'll be a ask anything about farm life, and I will tell you about farm life. <laughs> That'd be interesting, wouldn't it? Maybe not. Be interesting to me because I know all. I know. I know about it. <laughs> okay. Do I have enough to go across the top? I do not. It's not going to cooperate anyway. Yeah. What percent would you say of your farm is covered in... Covered in bees? Um, I'm not really sure how to answer that. Like, I have I have two hives. I'm getting... Can I freaking do this properly? Or are you trying to make a joke? Or bee bees? I think you're trying to, to pull my leg here. Oh no, my hammer is broken. I gotta go fix it. Let's fix our little hammer hammer. There we go. Yeah, you can you can talk about your bees. Beebies? Is this supposed to be boobies? Zero at this house. <laughs> for various reasons. Yeah, bees are cool. I'm getting um, getting some more hives this year. Can I put this properly, please? There we go. I have two hives currently. I don't know if they're dead or I don't know if they're dead or not. I haven't checked them this year yet, and I don't intend to. On Sunday, it's supposed to be plus twelve here. Can I? I hate that this does not this this does not work like it used to. It used to be to drag to the corner and it would work. But now it kind of doesn't do that. It's super annoying. Yeah. But, BBs was just my silly keep. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Bus spot, you know when to come in. You, you know where the right time to come in. That's for sure, buddy. You used to be able to click this and drag it up like this, and it would this would go up, but it doesn't seem to be the case anymore. Uh, I should actually just put some flooring in here because I want the the doorway to be here. Actually, that's going to kind of mess things up, won't it? Uh, no, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Uh, set tomorrow is going to be that, or is that going to be on Sunday? Because tomorrow here is still, is still going to be uh, chilly. Well, which, I mean, it's always colder here. But uh, 37, <laughs> yeah, it's just these... Oops, wrong building. These crazy temperature swings. Like, that's what happens in, in, in March, you know? It's down where my parents live down there in Pennsylvania. Uh, like, when my mom came up to visit last. She was up here last, like, last weekend. She, uh, like, there's like, yeah, it was 70 degrees the other day. And then, and then yesterday it was you know, 40 degrees. And, yeah, this is crazy. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, well, I mean, we still have a lot of snow. Um, so... Any sort of melt uh, would be... I'm not sure why I'm doing this three high inside. Eh, whatever. Uh, we still have a lot of snow here. So I'll be ready for the snow to kind of melt and get rid of some of the ice. We still have tons of ice. 
All right, and then let's see how we want to do this. We want to go up one more level here. So this is going to be the wall. Will that let me do it? Yes, it will. Thank you. So we still have a lot of uh, a lot of snow. Why does it? Mm, that's so annoying. We still have lots of snow and lots of ice. I mean, not a ridiculous amount, but enough that it's still a problem every day outside. Thank you, Stream Elements. Yes, anybody watching, just joining, hello and welcome. Please consider following. Getting very... So you saw what I did there, Jeff. So you click this, and you go to above this, right? And it doesn't do it. Why, I don't understand. It's It used to work that way, but now it it's probably not going to work here either. As long as it's highlighted, it should place it. But it doesn't, and it's super freaking frustrating. I wish they would. I wish they would assess the building stuff here a bit, because also they have it. So if you, if I left click to demolish this wall, it's gonna hammer. Oh, it's not doing it now. There, it did it twice. Like it does like a double hit, which is not what I want. I want a single hit. So it's annoying. <laughs> if I could complain about something. And there's a lot of good parts about this game, but there are a lot of bugs that don't seem to be ever looked at they just keep adding stuff about government and stuff that i don't think many people even use really but hey what do i know nope are you doing any uh are you doing any games today jeff i'm not sure if you're working today or what your what your schedule is what time is it is what 1 30. all right we got that looks not the best inside, but out outside it will look fine. Because you won't be able to tell that there's a... Uh, just looks like there's a break there. Oh, I guess I got an extra little piece of wood over there. Come on. Let's see, let's get some furniture in here. So, we can make this be the kitchen. Nope, this way. So we should start getting some housing, not this second, because I have to put in, I have to get my, maybe a little kitchen area. I have to get my claim marker, which is in here somewhere. Here we are, claim stake. Because you gotta own everything for it to count Oh, uh, thank you, Stream Elements. That was kind of an odd. Oh, okay, good. At least we're in the right zone here. Also, my UI is very big because I'm half blind. Not half blind, it's just, you know what I mean. It's hard to read. Certain things are hard to... Oh, yeah. I do want to change my res... Oh, I want to change my residency to... Yes. There we go. Now we should, hey, look at that. We have a housing score now. We have, she wants to call you out for the <laughs> Yeah, so like, maybe I have to change that because that's not a hyperlink. That's just at adding me. Can you add hyperlinks to stream elements? That I don't know. Like, I mean, you, you could add the www part. I just don't know if it would be a clickable link. I don't know. But yeah, it's... I don't know. Whatever. Good enough. <laughs> yes, the string elements is... We, we have a, a, a love-hate relationship. We have housing score now. A housing score of 14.3. The world multiplier is 5 because I'm doing no collab. So it's worth a lot more than it actually is worth. So it's actually worth 2.8, which is good. Probably I've seen it on other streamers. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff I haven't set up. My emoji thing, put an emoji in the chat. Because I must, I must just not be seeing it because it doesn't appear on my screen. Um, the chat should not be... Yeah, it's like two seconds behind. It should dance around on the screen unless I have that turned off somehow. No, it should be there. If you could just put a bunch of emotes... I just realized also that the chat, the chat
chat is actually literally right on top of that. So maybe we'll move the chat up here for this stream. I didn't realize that, which is kind of annoying. There, now you can actually kind of read it. it. Depends on what the background is. Some of them, there we go. <laughs> yeah, right. Where are they? Yeah, here. You can turn arachnophobia. They don't do anything. You can't kill them or anything. They're just, they don't, they're just there. I guess for, I mean, they disappear. Like that one disappeared. What is this one going to do? Like, they just crawl like on the floor. They don't go on the walls. That other one just disappeared into the floor. Like that one, like you can't disappear in the middle of a piece of wood. You go between the wood and you can't disappear out of thin air. It, it, spiders don't work that way. Look at that guy. I'm not sure what the purpose of the spiders are. It doesn't, it honestly doesn't, yeah, I can't, there's no fire in the guy. There's, it's the campfire, but you can't pick him up. You can't hit him. I guess if I would pick, if I pick this up, it falls through. <laughs> it did too. Let's see if you pick this one up. Is it going to fall through? Whoops. It did too. It fell. Oh, there's your problem. He, he fell too and I started to die. Oh, there's a log here. What the heck? Dropping logs. All right, let's replace the floor so we can not die. <laughs> there we go. All right, so we got one. There are a lot of... Sp I think it might be because of the biome I'm in. I'm in grassland slash forest biome right now. Like I'm in, I'm in, I am in between a couple of different biomes. Um, like, this is a different one than this, and then this is a different one, and this is a different one. So there's a bunch of different ones here. Yeah. Anyway. Trapdoor spiders. Yeah, right, exactly. Trapdoor spiders. All right, let's... Um, how many more human logs do we got? Not a lot. So let's just try to see if we can f do some more of this. Because now we know you can't corner pick anymore. It won't work. It's nice to get another room in. Actually, you know what? Let's go. I think I actually picked all the humans. Do we, do we have anything else in our... I swore I built more th or made more things. So I have another butchery table. And do we have any other furniture? I have, I have two beds. Two cat. Uh, these aren't the cat beds. These are people beds. And then I have a store which is irrelevant. Actually, I could put the store down if anybody has wants to see the store. Like to see what the how it's been changed. We can put the butchery table in here. And then these are going to be the bed. This will be the bedroom. Well, the bedroom will be upstairs, but for now it'll be right here. There you go. Sleep with your loved ones. Or suffocate them in your sleep. <laughs> Alrighty, so what do we want to do? Let's just get rid of these. As far as I know, you used to get experience when you chopped up stumps. Because uh, you do get experience when you clean up debris. But I don't believe... <laughs> but I do... I know a friend of mine uh, that I've known for many years. I don't get to see her. I've seen her. Last time I saw her was she's... I don't, I don't know how many years ago. Three? Like, it was a long time ago. And she lives down near the airport, not that far from me. But anyway, she doesn't drive. So any point being is, is that her and her partner they sleep in different beds, and right now they're in different rooms. Maybe that's by design, but oof. Uh, but yeah, I'm like, hmm, that might be nice sometimes. <laughs> Getting kicked there all the time. All right, got to repair all of our tools. Oh, we need some more rocks, which we do not have. Do you have to do a little bit of mining expedition? Do some mining. This looks different. The cart has changed. This used to be very plain, and the wheels look different. The handles used to be longer, too. I wonder if it still handles like crap. Eh, handles okay. That's different. It's cool, though. I mean, I wonder what the big cart looks like. Awesome. I didn't notice that before. There are, you know, there are sm small noticeable things that are, well, noticeable. We are doing mining, right? Yeah, we are doing mining. I got to get the the lucky break mining one, which makes line, mining less painful because if you see there, Jeff, every you only have a certain percentage chance to break these into four pieces. This one I have to break again, which is super not efficient. I mean, I only I only have stone tools, so I can't knock. I can't break granite uh, with one hit with this tool. We have the sandstone I could, but I'm not near the, like, I'm, I'm not in the desert area. Let's just get some more of this done. I don't need tons of rocks at the moment, but I will. 
And we're definitely missing one. There gotta be a piece. There we go, a piece missing. So let's just actually you used to be able to push these backwards quite easily. Now it's why can't I Oh, I think I have the controls set up wrong. Carts, they change the way that they handle them at the way that they handle, which it's like Oh my god, it's just a pain in the butt. I don't I'm not a fan, honestly. That was even before, like now. Uh, let's dump into this one. Uh, okay, that's good, good, good. Now we can repair our tools. I'm trying to think. I want to try to get more housing done, but I kind of want to take a little bit of a break. Scythe, we don't need. How close to be on logging? We're actually not that bad, really. Gathering is good. Mining is okay. So we've got to follow the research. So i got to wait for a star, which is going to be in... Two hours. That is a long time. Can we craft a bow? So I need to get some meat. That's why my my score is so bad. I can do five sets of arrows. And then wooden bow. We'll do some hunting. I can eat corn, I think. It's just the charred corn I don't like. And there used to be better. When you would eat a piece of food, it would give you a better pop-up down here. I'm pointing at it, but down here, it would give you a better pop-up of when you would eat something, what it what the bonus was. It doesn't do that anymore. It just shows here, which I, actually I don't like. Let's just eat all this stuff. Why not? There we go. What are we doing here? Let's get our little bow. Now, hunting is a bit kind of iffy sometimes. Where are my arrows? I only have 20 arrows. That doesn't seem like a lot. Let's make some more arrows. Let's make 10 which would be 40. Now, hunting. Let's see. Do we have anything around us? Now, one thing they did update in the game is in the map settings, the world layers, they have animal um, habit habitability, and they also have population. So, like coyotes, it tells you where they're going to be. They're going to be here because they love the desert. Deer, which is in more of a grass grasslandy area. Elk, same, and then bison, similar. Yeah, okay, cool. Let's uh, let's grab the rest of these arrows, and let's go see if we can get some meat. Now, the problem is whenever you're not wanting to hunt is when you find all the animals. Hmm. You can sneak by pressing control. You just like to look down and see if there's anything down here. I don't see anything. Oh, there's a deer over there. Oh, there's a ooh, there's the elk. Now the question is, can I hit that? I gotta wait for him to stop. Like the pathing and stuff is so uh Oh, yeah, sure, Jeff. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. I will, uh, if there's game night tonight, if I'm around or see how things are, if you're around, I'll, I'll probably see you then. Thanks for stopping by. Have a good rest of your afternoon. Maybe the wolf will kill it for me. Oh, I'm definitely missing everything now. Could shoot the hares, but I really don't want to shoot the little ones. Shoot you right in your f crap. You want to die? Yeah, come attack me, dude. All good, bro. Jeez, how much damage is this guy going to take? You should be able to hit him in the face if they just die. But they don't. Plus, I have no skill in, in hunting. I have no bonus skills. These guys just keep running right around here. What, are you the buffalo that I shot at before? 
Come on. He's running in a straight line. I don't know what, what are these animals doing, seriously? Can you just die already, please? Like, there's so many arrows in you. Oh, there we go. Knocked him down. Oh, I killed that thing, too, without even realizing it. I should just wait here, because they're going to come back, won't they? He's right there. Hunting is fun when you're half decent at it. Are you going to die, wolf? There you go. Get me some meat. I'm going to get some of these big ones, though. How many shots are you going to take, my friend? There we go. Alright, we have a lot to collect now. I'm not sure I don't remember hitting a turkey, but alright. I don't know if I can carry all this. That's the question. Uh, oh, there's a big spider. I can carry. Oh, okay. My inventory is okay. I'd like to find that bison that ran down in here. <clears throat> I don't know where he went. There he is. Animal pathing is still a bit weird in the game. Is that not him right there? Or is he dead? Oh, he's dead. <laughs> we got a lot of meat now. However, I can't process any of it. So I really don't get that good of a bone of a return on it. So it's not the best thing in the world. Hey, Wally. I saw you were playing game earlier. I'm just trying to get some meat. How's your day go? Jeff was just here. I'm sure you saw that in the chat. He's uh, party pooping. Nice to meet you. Yeah, right. Hunting is still not any better in the game. Like, I'm just shooting. Look at this. Deer has like six arrows in it. You don't get the arrows back, which, I mean, I'm not sure if that maybe that's a skill that you get back. Oh, you're you. Hey, what's up, dude? What's up, dear? I don't have any skill. I don't have any, or uh, I'm not in. I didn't take hunting. So I'm just trying to, how many do I got? 10 less. I'm going to try to get a bunch of meat because my diet's, like I should be able to shoot you right in the face and you should just die because that's how real life would work. Not like shooting you 50 times. Here he comes again. How much are you going to take, buddy? Oh my god, I'm going to run out of hours before I kill him. Yeah, there I got him. Got, oh, there was a waste. Awesome. Uh, I think that's a lot of meat. Oh, we have a deer yet. Can I shoot you, deer? A doe? A deer? I have two arrows, so I'm not going to waste the two arrows on them. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Someone left some garbage. <laughs> oh, there's something right here. What was this animal? Oh, there's something right there. Maybe I could kill, I could catch butterflies. What is that noise? That's right, we got a lot of meat. The process, the problem is I don't have anything to process it with. Like I'm not a, I have the butchery table, but I'm not, uh, I don't have butchery. So it kind of is, it's, it's, it stinks. Cause you definitely don't get a, you don't get a good return on it. And I, my next star isn't for a while. And I need to get masonry to get the other, I mean, it's a lot, it's a lot to do. Got to go as well. This oh, thanks for stopping in, Wally. Um, are we doing a community night game night? We might have left already, but thank you anyway for stopping stopping by. For doing golf, I'm definitely be doing golf. Oh, there is something up. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go vote for golf. The other ones don't really appeal to me, honestly. But uh, yeah, I saw it. Thanks, Wally. Cool. Yeah, thanks for stopping by. Hopefully you have a good rest of your day. Now, what do we have here as far as... 
Um, meat. So we have three. You have a turkey. You have a wolf or a coyote, a wolf carcass. We have a bison. We have a deer. So that's what we have. Now, let's see. What can we get out of that? Um, the bison would probably be the... Am I not hooked into this chest? Oh, this. That's why. Okay. We can output it into, into one of these. So probably the bison is the best thing because it uses a whole bison, not like part of one. You get eight things from that. Let's just do, I mean, it's not as good as, obviously it's not as good as if you have butchery, which I will eventually. And I mean, I could cheese in stars too, but it's like, you know what? I really don't want to do that. Um, yeah, okay, cool. Alrighty, so that's going. It's daylight. We got our little stilt house. Should probably fix that a little bit. Do we have pillars in this one? We do have columns. Can I not grab that? Oh, come on. Seriously, I thought I could grab that. Can I not get out of this? Ah, that's okay. There we go. Should be to grab this now. There we go. Looks a little bit more realistic, I guess. At least that one does. Why am I swimming so fast? That ah, whatever. We're just gonna leave the rest of. It. I can't. I can't get it at the moment. And get this one. I only have two, two hewn logs left anyway. Nope. Hey, that worked. <laughs> anyway. Alrighty, let's get, uh, let's see, where are we at right now? We got, we're waiting on stars. We got to get some more furniture made. Uh, let's see, what can we make now? Can we, make, we can make a couple benches, which is still under seating. It's a skill value of one. Uh, it costs more. No, it costs the same. 50% less. So two of these would give you 1.5. And here you'd have to do... Yeah, I always forget if benches are better. We can do some benches. We can do a dresser. What's the value on this? It's only a 0 0.5. So that's actually not that, that good. Uh, and then I can do a few tables. If I want eight tables. A couple of latrines. And the beds I have. Okay, cool. And I also have to go up in here and get some boards. Because boards are, we're going to need about probably 50 boards. Probably even more than 50 boards. And we got to get some more. Uh, we got to work, we got to put our work order in for all these, our labor in. Let's eat some food. Some of this, some of this, some of this. Some of that. And there you go. Okay, cool. The rest is in. Now we just got to get some more, so get some more logs. Actually, might not even need that. Let's just, let's just cut some stuff down here. Why not? So, hello and welcome, everybody. If anybody's just, just stopping in. Oh, that's not the way I wanted it to fall, but hey, what are you going to, what do you, what am I, what should I expect? You yeah, want to play for another maybe 15 minutes, and then I'm definitely going to, I think I'm going to switch over to my Rogue Tower game for the rest of the day. Or maybe, I actually picked up, I know you're not here anymore, Wally, um, but uh, I did, uh, I didn't know. I forgot that I actually bought Autumn Chef. It was only it was it was on sale on Steam right now. I think it's like five dollars or four dollars Canadian. So I figured mine as well because it was fun. The demo was fun, and hopefully I get a bit of um, interest on YouTube. If I do, then I'll play it, like make a series out of it. I know Lana's doing that. Uh, I think she's still doing that at the moment. 
She's a lot of games on the go. I'm trying to, to not do that because I don't still have the time for it. I mean, I guess today I could be doing it. But anyway, we're going to roll through here. I also picked up another game. It's called, for anybody out there who's listening, it's called Another Brick Brick in the Mall. I played through it a little bit yesterday, maybe like a half hour last night. And that's fun too. I think it'll be a game. It's, it's the graphics and it's set up the same way almost like Prison Architect is, like the way you drag the foundations and stuff. Which Prison Architect, I remember playing that game when it like first came out. Which I don't even know how long ago that was at this point. It seems like it's forever ago. Many years. That was always a fun game. Then it got very complicated. The different prisoners and stuff. But it was fun nonetheless. Yeah, okay, buddy. Cool. Problem is I can't kill you with this. I should be able to kill you with this, but you can't. Like, doesn't really make any sense, but alright. Fair enough. Alright, got these button bushes here. Yeah, I'd like to eventually, once, I mean, this, this, is the house that I have now is almost like it's just a bit of a temporary house. I gotta figure out my final location. Once I start scaling up more, I can start producing a bit better. I can kind of set things just to let them run as a set of a funnel, like maybe a little town. We'll see. We'll see what we get up to. No promises. Nope. I don't want to open you. I want to take you over here. I use you to piggyback between two of them. So this one's going to go into this one. Just like that. And we should start hewing now, right? Do I have anything on the go? Oh, I can't. Um, shoot, I totally forgot about that. So one of these things, I need eight hewn logs. I think the Q is still... Shoot. Um, let's cancel the latrine, because I forgot I have to do hewn logs first. Let's do another hundred. Let's do regular hewn logs. It doesn't really matter for this, but... They'll take it as it needs to, which is fine with me. Got a lot of cedar in there. We do have a bench ready though. Let's see, grab we have a bench. And swap out with this. I don't need this at all at the moment. Uh, any other, oh, let's eat some of this. This will give us some good fats. So our scores at 137 should go, should start going way up. Even though I just like burned through all of them. Let's see, oh actually, you know what, let's see. This is our first meat. Let's see, do I like... We got the bonus now. Do I like meat? Oh, no. Charred meat, bad. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good at all. My bonus is only at plus 3%. That's terrible. Who doesn't like charred meat? What the heck's going on? Well, that's going to be a problem then. So I got to like uh, do something else with the meat, I guess. Hmm. All right. This is going to be... This will be the bedroom eventually. Um, you can put a bed here, I guess. Have like a sitting bench over here. Oh yeah, I don't have enough hewn to finish the top of this either. That's the problem. Uh, I can't grab that. Okay, never mind. So leave that. Leave, leave it alone. Leave it alone. Cool. How are we doing on carpentry? My carpentry is at level five, or sorry, at level three. It's going up. There you go. It goes up when you're well. Hewing is under, under logging. Yeah, I should almost max it out pretty soon. All right, cool. Making some good progress. Oh, there's a log I missed. Shoot. Oh, there's a couple over here I missed as well. Huh. Hello, Jaguar or a Cheetah, whatever those ones are with the spots. All right, very good, very good, very good. We got a little bit of a house going here. We got some furniture being made. I actually should cut this way down. And, well, no, I need this size. I need to be this size. Failed to handle RPC response. I'm not sure what that was. Also, hello and welcome to anybody just stopping by. Hope everybody is having a fantastic day. 
I'm missing boards. Oh, I must have got some more furniture. Ooh, I got another dresser. Or a dresser. Let's go check out. Let's go see what that looks like in game. Hmm. Maybe this bed has to go. Or do, maybe the beds have to go a different way. Because they're kind of cramping my style here a bit. Put the bed here. And of course, I misclicked. So, what the heck was that? That's not. This needs to be this. There. Let's see the dresser. It only gives you half a point, which is not the best thing ever. It's nice, though. This looks pretty cool. The thing is, though, is it does open, but the problem is that you will never see it open because it blurs the screen when you open it. So I don't, I don't like that at all. But what are you gonna do, right? All right, we're almost level <clears throat> six. Almost level six. For some reason, I still remember there being... Oh, there is level 7. Okay, duh. Uh, level 5. I will level up and I'll get my next bonus, my next talent. Which, I don't know if those have been changed. Because it usually would be cleanup crew or... I'm not sure what the other one is. Well, let's go and sleep. We don't need to be awake right now. Let's just sleep through the night a little bit. A couple hours. And then we can uh, wake up when we ding our level over. Which will be very soon. All right, come on, sunshine. There it is. All right, let's wake on up. How did I not level up yet? Doing tons of hewing, aren't I? Let's put a hewing first, then. Another bench, which is nice. And we have some tables. Oh, I leveled up. Let's check out. Oh, that's the self-improvement level five. Oh, there's logging level five. Okay. Oh, hey, Peps. Yeah, I, um, the other day, like, there's a new, the 9.5 snapshot, or whatever you want to call it, came out. So I just, uh, did a stream of that. I guess it was, um, I don't know, maybe over the weekend or earlier the week, going over the new features, and I started just to kind of mess around with it, play a little bit. Yeah, why not? Um, I've only ever done the co-op, or the multiplayer with, like, Wally's and Kyle Adorn and even Catherine of Sky b back in the day. Um, but yeah, I figured, why not? See if cleanup crew. I wonder if any of these. This one doesn't do anything, and this one never worked before either. So we'll find out to see if it actually does work this time. I don't think it does. Self improvement. We need to get level six, which I don't believe these don't do anything either. I wish they would work on these. It's kind of like frustrating that they don't work on stuff like that, and they add stuff that no one cares about. But yeah, I had the itch. Peps. Uh, also, thank you for stopping by. Had the itch to kind of play it. Let's see. Maybe put another bench on this side with a, a table. There we go. We have to get some, some wood for the roof, by the way, because we don't have any. We don't have the roof done. Let's see if we can get the roof finished on this nice sunny day. Except mm, there's still some things, issues here with building that are like that did not build. Why? So you left click and you left click. There, that one worked. I do like the game. I mean, early gaming. Playing it, perhaps with, with multiple people, obviously, is, is a lot more fun because everybody can do a different thing and you can, you know, chat about what you're doing and whatever. But uh, this is fun nonetheless. I was doing, um, whoops, yesterday I was doing a, a game that's called uh, Rogue Tower. I think that's what it's called, Rogue Tower? Like a rogue tower defense. Oh, our housing score went up. Wow, we already have reduction. What are we reducing? Uh, this, the bed. That's okay, we're gonna leave it. Oh, what was that? Ooh, that's carpentry. Let's go check that out. Uh, wait. Oh, okay, yeah, I can make the uh, bookshelves, which I can't because you need paper. The nightstand, which also needs lumber, I think. Oh, no, I can make the nightstand, large, the lumber stockpile. We don't have lumber yet. Registrar, towel rack, which, again, needs cotton and lumber, which, well, we don't have, of course. Yeah, I never got into the game either. Yeah, it's, it's um, 
Yeah, I know. I think you always used to comment uh, in in Caledoran's Discord when we were doing it. <laughs> just could never get just could never get into. Which I get. I mean, it's a uh, it's, it's hard to compare it to another type of game. It's not like a Factorio or Satisfactory. There's no real automation. I mean, you set orders to, to tables and stuff, but it's not like automation in that sense. It's just crafting. Um, well, I guess it's almost like open world survival in a sense, but yet, well, it's like Minecraft. I guess Minecraft would be the best way to describe it, except you, you can't die in the game. Uh, so you, you can't die. You can't fall off things. Uh, you can't I mean, you get attacked by animals, but all that does is take away your calories, which is... I'm not sure what the point of even putting that in the game. It serves no purpose in my opinion, but hey, whatever. The game looks nice, though. What was that ding? I guess I think it's just in my earphones. But yeah, I mean, it's not for everyone. I like it, personally. Just you know, to kind of putter around uh, with, and, and it has some nice new features. This uh, this update, which there hasn't been a huge update, it's not like a game changing update, but there have been it has been there has been an update, so it's good. What are we doing here? We're missing boards, uh, making boards. Okay, cool. Uh, what else do we have in here? Tables. Oh shoot! I totally forgot to ask Wally that question about the big shovel when he was here. I'm like, if he shows up, I want to ask him. Totally forgot. I put a table here and maybe maybe a table in the middle, which wouldn't make any sense. Maybe there. I need to get some more chairs in here. Our housing score is actually not bad. I mean, we're capped. We're over. Yeah, we're, the reduction's up, but that's okay. That's perfectly okay. This room, we're way over tapped with or over done with. And I think we got to figure out how are we going to get up to the next level? Usually, I don't really make it so it's functional in the sense it's just you cram it with stuff and then that's pretty much the way you do it but in single player again like i could spawn in everything that i want and just spawn in what i need but i don't know nice little pumpkin there our food actually our food intake is not terrible however the biggest update perhaps if you're still here was with the with the the way food works so before you have a food score, carb, protein, fat, vitamins, right? So you had certain combinations of food that gave you the best food score. Well, what they've done is they've changed it to give you, well, three different bonuses. Variety bonus, so you eat more than the same thing. Uh, the balanced diet bonus always existed. It's just laid out differently now. But the big one is this, the tastiness bonus. So everyone has different tastes determined randomly and discovered by eating. You have one favorite and one least favorite food. So that gives you a plus 30 or minus 30%. And then you have a variety of foods here. Like for instance, charred corn is horrible. So I have a 20% reduction of the 4% of my diet. So there's a lot of calculating going on in this. Bad, bad. Some are okay, which those are indifferent. And I have some that are delicious. Like I love pineapple. Put it 0% right now because there's none in my stomach. Charred fish is okay. So all the things that I'm eating are, are all okay. Charred beans, good, good, good. Corn, not just, this is just where it's weird, right? So I like corn, raw corn, but I don't like charred corn. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> doesn't make any sense. But I mean, I think it's just quite random. There's no rhyme or reason behind it. It's just, it's like tomatoes, I don't like bad, minus 10. But charred tomatoes are okay at zero. So it makes the farming, the cooking, gathering, farming, skills a lot more uh, diverse a lot more viable now i think at least well, thank you beats i think at least all righty let's get some wheat going not that i need wheat at the moment but there's some here so i might as well harvest it no nope, that's not wheat i don't need any rice what is that is that rice or wheat i mean this is wheat there have been some other map updates and upgrades or whatever. I do like pineapple, but I can never eat it. Yeah, I, uh, but the thing is, though, that'd be the same thing as saying, like, well, like, do you like pineapple, but not grilled pineapple? Um, it's not so much in things. I mean, as you get later into the tiers of food, it, it, it is like that where you, anything that had, well, at least from my experience, from, I mean, I didn't look through all the food types. I looked through some of them. That it is like that. It's like, well, if you don't like tomatoes, don't you can't you don't like the tomatoes in a salad. 
which makes sense somewhat. I mean, for me, it's like I don't like tomatoes, but I like tomato sauce. However, though, I, I agree. I do not like pineapple on pizza. If you're in my chat and you are in watching the stream that you like pineapple, people speak up so I can shame you because pineapple does not belong on pizza. If you are Italian or anywhere near that, you do not like pineapple on pizza. I said it. There you go. When I make my pizza at home, I'm sure if you've ever seen the pictures, uh, Peps, uh, I do not, pineapple is the farthest thing away from what I put on my pizza. Of course I'm kidding with everybody. If you like pineapple on your pizza, go ahead and enjoy it. Just don't bring it to my house ever. So I'll throw it right in the garbage. <laughs> uh, jokes. We're in the desert. We should actually start, we don't need iron because we can't do anything with it yet. A lot of this game, though, Peps, is waiting. I mean, there's if multiplayer, there's always something to do because someone's doing mining, someone's doing locking, someone's doing carpentry. Uh, you're not waiting for, like, these to go up, at least this part of the, the game, I guess. But what we could do is... I'm trying to think what skill I want to go towards next. I mean, cooking would be good. Oh. This used to be called advanced campfire cooking. Cutting egg, cutting eggs cooking still is ethanol. What does that do? Oh, this is different. Have they updated this? Cornstarch. Oh, this is different. Okay, this is different then. This isn't. This this still goes into absolutely nothing but the ethanol and the, this is different cornstarch is now in cutting edge cooking what do you need cornstarch for oh never mind use it for this which is basically used for nothing all right ignore my previous statement ethanol goes into what biodiesel which is used but like that's eh eh these, these, I don't understand this, this, um, cutting edge cooking peps has been in the game. I think since the beginning, it's, there's no use for it. There's absolutely no reason to use it. It doesn't, it doesn't get you anything. As you see, there's nothing here. It's pointless. So I don't know why they keep it in the game. It's, it's, it's stupid. <laughs> to be honest with you, it's stupid. I might want to get going towards tailoring next. So we can really start getting our skills. And where is tailoring under? Down here. So tailoring, let's, let's look into that while we're waiting. So tailoring skill book. That might make sense. Hopefully I can get it. So we need three gathering research basics and we need three basic research tags. So we need gathering. Oh, look at that. One, two. Oh, we don't have quite. Well, I have raw food in my, in my inventory though. Is this linked? To, oh, it's not even linked to anything. That's why. There we go. Done. That one's easy. And then can I do a couple more? The easiest ones would be these. One, two, that's three. There we go. That'll give us our three and three. Because you just need three gathering. Then you can also have three generic, but three or three basic, but but a gathering is basic. Let's work towards that. Oh, hey, Marshall. How you doing? I saw you were doing... What the heck? What was the game called? It wasn't Guild Wars, was it, earlier today? Or was that yesterday? I know I saw you on... Um, I think it had to be today, earlier this morning. Or, well, earlier this morning, my time. All right, Dragon Quest. I knew it was something with, like, Quest in the name. How's that? I've never played that. What, what type of game is that like? Is that like a Guild Wars or those, those type of games? Or is it totally different? Like a deck building game. I'm trying to hydrate. Peps and Marshall, I'm getting close to that 50 followers. I'm at, or I'm at uh, 44. Despite it not being updated on my goal thing, I'm at 44 uh, followers. So we're getting very close. Um, I'm kind of getting excited about that. It is exciting, of course. Do I have all the labor put into this? I do. Oh, what was that? What did I just ding up? Ooh. Oh, gathering level three. Oh, because I'm making the research papers. Let's see. 
Where's gathering under? Under here. I get a bonus. What is this bonus? Lowers the calorie cost of using related tools. That would be using your scythe. Your scythe. Or increases the tier of related tool. Now, I don't think this matters with this. Because the only thing you're gathering is like wheat and stuff. So, I'm going to do calories, of course. It's in the vein of Dragon Quest, but your builders set out to rebuilding the world. Hmm. Okay, well, I never played Dragon, the first Dragon Quest. I've never, I've never seen that game, but that's interesting. Are they realistic graphics, or is it like a voxel-type graphics or something kind of like in between, which I guess this would be kind of in between. Well, this is, I guess these are voxel graphics. There's the meteor. What's up, dude? 29 days. Alrighty, so I gotta wait. So let's just go to sleep, actually. We don't need to be awake. Uh, we can we can kind of sleep through the night and try to get our our experience up a bit more. Cause I don't really don't want to wait for t I don't want to have to wait ten hours to get to the next door. Cause what time is it? I gotta yeah I gotta have a little bit more time. So it'd be nice to get gathering or excuse me to get tailoring up and running. Let's just wait and we're gonna ding up. Oh, there we go. Let's wake up. So we kind of slept the whole day there, which kind of cheating, but that's okay. It's not cheating because in in multiplayer, the game's running all the time anyway, so it's a single single player mechanic. I want to start getting some. I want, I want to start getting tons of things, getting some farms going. I gotta, I gotta find a better better area to make some farms. The Dragon Quest games have a similar look to each other. Okay, okay, yeah, I'll have to look that up because I'm not I'm not familiar with that. Uh, let's see, has this finished? That's not what I'm looking at either. This one. All right, finished. Let's see, where is this? I can probably pick up again. I have 8,000 tables. Is this one? No, not carpentry. Is this one tailoring? And we got the scroll. And hey, now we are tailor. Why do I have another? S oh, because I have to take it. Duh. What did I just level up there? Oh. What? Why do I have another star? No, I didn't actually take it. Yeah, okay, I learned it. I want to learn this to start getting some some rugs going. Let's just do this. So I need to make a loom. L and share some characters with Dragon Ball since they share the artist. Okay, like the Dragon Ball Z or is Dragon Ball something different from that yet? I've heard of Dragon Ball Z. I've never, I've never seen it, like myself. Okay, let's. Uh, should actually make one of these while we're at it, because I definitely want to get engineering. I have so much, so much that I want to, uh, want to do. Well, sure. I was going to take masonry to get the the other uh, upgrades. Whoopsies, whoopsies. I don't like charred meat, but I got to eat it to get my my score back up. Let's eat some more of this stuff, just to eat it. Uh, thank you, Stream Melons. Yes, consider if you are just following a new a new follower, new new watcher, new viewer, please consider subscribing. That would help me out greatly. I'm almost getting close to the uh, affiliate level. Then I can start having like the what do Wally call them? The uh, the channel point reward things, or you can make me do things, or I can tell you a story about the '80s, which is a great time, <laughs> you know. So I picked, oh, this is just rice. All right, anyway, okay, cool, tailoring. So we need some more, um, we have, we need more boards. What is it? Oh, shoot, I got a hewn thing. That is the problem. This is working. I oh, know, I need, uh, I need more boards. Um, that's the problem here. I hate cutting that off, but I have to. Nope. Hold on. Nope. I need to get about another 40. Uh, yeah, let's do it like the, this will go here as well. There. There we go. Original artist. Cool. 
Yeah, Marshall, I just popped the one here doing, well, Eco for a little bit now. I guess this is the third, well, second stream, but third. I made an, ep an actual episode about it, which this isn't much of an episode type game. It's more of a streaming game. I cannot make that jump, can I? Yeah, there we go. But yeah, I'm not really, uh, I don't have any set goals. Just kind of, just play him. We should, what are we going to work on now? The tailoring stuff. So that has to build. And we're also going to need a module as well, which is going to be, oh, I can't make a module anyway. So that, never mind with that. What do we have in here? We have all this, the things, we don't like charred meat. That's the, that's the biggest problem here. We don't like charred meat, which stinks. It really stinks. I don't need this button grass. Bunch grass is pointless. I have a little bit of food here. Oh, here's my food here. They changed how this works, which is kind of annoying, but whatever. We got this to go here. We got food here, food here. Good, good. This can go like that. Something is full. Okay, good. My multiplier actually isn't that bad right now. What are we gaining? Every four hours. So, okay, cool. Um, but I do think it is, yeah, I've been on it. It is 222. So I am out of time. Let's see if there's anybody that I can just raid very quickly. We have a few people in chat here. Someone as well trying to set something up. Let's see who's on right now that I want to read. Um, I guess we could do this one, Dr. Doof. Because why not? I want to set up the raid for that. There we go. Cool. So yeah, thanks for stopping by, guys. Um... Yeah, had fun. Had fun today, I should say. All right, let's just send him a, a hello and go from there. Thanks a lot, guys, and I'll catch you next time.